Hi, I'm Greg from Motorsports Innovations and today I've put together a demonstration of the Race Pack infrared temperature sensor and the IQ3 dash working together the display temp tire temperatures during and after the burnout and some other cool things we can do with IR temperatures. Now my little test, I've got a cup of uh, almost boiling water, it was boiling a few minutes ago, a Miller Lite which is uh, 40 degrees or so in temperature. The IQ3 I have programmed to show the temperature, IR temperature in this quadrant. I also have the two warning lights, warning light I think two and four programmed, one for a cold temperature and one for a hot temperature and I'll demonstrate that in a second. I also have my laptop running in telemetry mode which of course shows the real-time temperature. So let's, uh, let's get started and try a few things. So my, the temperature of the palm of my hand is about 85. Let's see if we get my wrist a little bit warmer there. Okay, 89 degrees there. We'll put it on the coffee cup, coffee mug, and we immediately go to 160. And warning light four is on saying it went above, I think I programmed it to 100 degrees. Likewise, when we go to the Miller Lite bottle, we get a temperature of 39 and warning light number two is on because temperature went below I think I programmed 40 degrees. Likewise what we show in telemetry for logging and diagnosis as I switch it from the hot coffee cup to the cold beer to my hand for ambient you see how it follows and it is very quick so we'll look at that again on the IQ3 dash. There's the beer, there's the coffee cup, see how quickly that moves. So in terms of do, getting tire temperature during a burnout, it's going to be very fast. The sensor is durable, it's used on top fuel cars, it's used on Formula One cars, it's really a strong piece. What I find is really attractive about it is to have it mounted to use for getting other items that you're interested in the temperature of. So whether it be the transmission cooler or some part of the cooling system, the oil pan, the transmission pan, you have a lot of possibilities. Now, Race Pack of course makes sensors for uh, exhaust and they're the EGTs and this would not replace that. And even say for a liquid temperature of uh, oil temperature, if you wanted to monitor that uh, the whole season, you would want to buy the correct sensor. But if you're just interested in uh, monitoring some things and moving this sensor around to six different places over the course of the racing season, this is an excellent buy at 325 bucks to be able to do that and display on the IQ3 what the temperature is at that particular time if you want to change your game plan in racing dependent on that. So to wrap this up, I think this is a great value at 325 bucks. You're going to learn a lot of stuff and improve your racing program. The sensor and any of the pieces in the package are available from any race pack dealer. My number is 609-265-2110. Thanks.